Okay. Hello YouTube, it's Keanu Dave again. Um, today I'm going to show you my Doctor Who DVD collection. It will be divided in six parts, so we'll start with the 60s. So, here we go with the first ever story, Unearthly Child. It's actually quite good, not as bad as what fans figure out to be. They only watch it for like part one, but it's actually not that bad. I quite liked it, uh, and it's a good start to the show, and a good start to the William Holden era. Uh, the Daleks, which introduces to, to the first villains in the show. Uh, the first villains in the show. Uh, yeah, it's a, this one's a fantastic story, probably my favourite out of the beginnings box set. So definitely, this one's definitely worth a watch. Definitely. This one's definitely worth a watch. Definitely worth a watch. It's a destruction. Another good story, this one. It has a bit of a plot twist to it. A bit of a plot twist to it. A bit of a plot twist to it. Like who Savage Charles the TARDIS. Uh, and uh, it's very well done. It's quite quite a good story, but but I but a little bit more stronger than Unearthly Child. So yeah, quite good two-part of story. Uh, the Dalek Invasion of Earth. Uh, great story, but not as good as as the as the Daleks. But I prefer it over the movie version. The movie version just was just a bit too quick, and it just really didn't follow the 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 episode the TV version. So, not that good, but it's still a great story, nonetheless. The drum, the the drumming soundtrack when they are invading London is very well done. Gotta say, it felt very modern like, felt like very, it felt like very 21st century soundtrack. Uh, the Space Museum, I haven't really seen this one yet, I should, so I, I can't judge my own opinion on it. Uh, the the Chase. Now this is another, this is a really fantastic, fantastic story. It's probably like my favourite out of the, out of the William Hartnell era and probably my favourite, uh, one of my favourite Dalek stories. The first is being Romans of the Daleks. Uh, it's very underrated. It's such an unappreciated story. I think you should really give it another chance because it's not that bad as what fans say it is. Uh, the Time Middler. No, I, I haven't really seen this one yet, so I can't, just like the Space Museum, I can't really judge my opinion on it. Uh, the Gunfighters, quite a good story. Quite a good story for a Wild West, for a Wild West theme, and, and it's quite good. One of my, one of my favourite Willie Martinell stories. Very well done. Uh... The War Machines, another fantastic Willie Hotnell story. This one is probably like my second favorite out of the out of the Willie Hotnell era, and and I think this one's very well done. They should def they should definitely bring the War Machines back to the new series because it would be nice how they to see them interact with with Capita Cabaldi's Doctor. Yeah, so this one's another fantastic story. Very well done. And now we head into the tenth planet, which is the introduction, which brings us to the introduction of the Cybermen and the first idea of regeneration. And what to say? It's a great, a fantastic story and a great way to end the William Hartnell era. So, yep, very well done. 